Hello, my dear students. Today I'm going to start with the listening of Unit 9. Let's read together what is it about. Um, listen to Hassan and Tar. It's a conversation between Hassan and Tar. Hassan says, Hassan says, Hi, Tar. Tar, hello, Hassan. How are you? Hassan, I'm fine, thanks. What are you doing later this afternoon? Would you like to go to the sports club to play football? So he's asking him, Would you like to join me to go to the club? this morning so Tower said I'm sorry I'd love to but I can't because I'm going shopping he told him I'm sorry I can't come with you because I have to go shopping with my sister take care I said go shopping go shopping take care from this with my sister Manel she knows someone who plays in an orchestra what is the meaning of orchestra team or people who are playing music together so they are coming here to play in a concert soon. What the meaning of concert? It's a music party, music party. So we are going to hand out information to people about the concert. So we are going hand out. What the meaning of hand out? We are going to give. So hand out means to give. So we are going to give the information to the people about the concert, about the party. So I'm afraid I can't play football today. So I'm afraid that I can't play football today. Hassan, tell me more about the orchestra. Would you please tell me more about the orchestra? What is this? Tari, the orchestra, which is called the El Nur Wil Amal Orchestra. It's called El Nur Wil Amal. The name of the orchestra is El Nur Wil Amal. Was set up, started, set up means started, the care set up with E, set up in the 19th fest for blind girls and women. So it's an orchestra. People are playing music in 1950s for blind girls and women. So, for blind girls and women. Blind means people who can't see. They all read music in Braille. All of them are reading music in Braille. Imagine this. Hassan, that's a great achievement. Wow, it's really a great achievement. Tar, yes it is. They travel all over the world and their next concert is here in two weeks time. Yes. They travel all around the world, and their concert will be here in two weeks. I'd like to invite you with, to it. Can you come? So I would like you to join this and come to, to watch the orchestra and listen to them. Can you come? Hassan, I'd love to. It sounds great. Yes, I'd love to come. It sounds great. I want to watch them. It sounds great. So take care here. Set up means started. Hand out means give. And concert, it's a party, okay? So these are the new vocab in this uh, paragraph. Let's go to the second paragraph, reading the deaf school in Cairo. Let's read about the deaf school in Cairo. The deaf school in Cairo was set up in 1982 for children from all over Egypt. There are about 70 children at the school. What meaning of deaf people? Deaf people who can't hear. So, there are about 70 children at the school where most of them live during the week. They go home at weekends and during the holidays. So, it's like um, a school where they can stay and they are just going to see their parents and their families during the holidays. At the school, students learn Egyptian sign language. So, sign language, making signs with their hands, okay, and heads in order to give you the meaning of the word or tell you something. Uh, they also learn reading and writing in Arabic and English math, science, PE, and computer studies. So they learn a lot of things about the subjects. The teachers at the deaf school believe that it's really important for deaf people to be able to communicate with people who can hear. So in this school, they can be able to learn how to deal with people. They encourage the family and friends of deaf students to take up sign language themselves at special weekly classes for people who can hear. They also plan activities where both deaf people and people who can hear can learn about each other's life. So also they encourage the deaf people to make um, some activities with the other people. More schools are now open for deaf learners all over Egypt, so nowadays we have all schools for deaf people in all over Egypt. Moreover, slightly deaf, what well, the meaning of slightly here means partly, not, not deaf at all, but slightly deaf means partly deaf. 
students are now included. So also in deaf schools, we can find people who can he can't hear well, but they can hear just a part, okay? Uh, students are now included in general education schools so that they can be with other students that hear well. So by this way, the deaf people can join the people who are slightly deaf, who can't hear well. So this is the reading of the unit, reading and listening. Okay. And now I'm going to answer with you the sheets. 